Hi everyone, I'm Coach MJ and this is Usapang Isiban. Today we're going to talk about Pag sinabing mental health, it includes our emotional, psychological, and social well-being. It affects how we think, feel, and act. It also determines how we handle stress, relate to others, and make decisions. Mental health is very important at every stage of life. At isa ito sa mga pinaka na sa atin ngayong pandemya. According to Oxford Academics, we can see in this chart, Figure 1. Suicidal behavior in vulnerable populations in the COVID-19 era. According to this chart, COVID-19 may produce uncertainty, which can cause anxiety, fear, and worry. Social isolation, which is a critical factor in our mental health, and economic problems, which has a severe effect on our mental health as well. These three factors can affect the most vulnerable people, including individuals with pre-existing psychiatric disorders, low resilient people, individuals who reside in high COVID-19 prevalence areas, and people who have a family member or friend who has died of COVID, which may result to exacerbation of pre-existing psychiatric disorders, depressive disorders, anxiety disorders, alcohol and other substance use disorders, and other psychiatric conditions, which may result or are associated with suicide or suicidal tendencies. There is a study that says one person every 40 seconds die from suicide every year. At nakakalungkot dahil lumaki ang posibilidad na mas dumami ito dahil sa nararanasan natin ngayong pandemya. So, how do we take care of our mental health during this pandemic? Number one, stay connected. Connect with friends via cell phone through call or text, telephone, and online messaging and video applications. Number two, stay physically fit and healthy. Eat healthy foods, exercise, and have sufficient sleep. To avoid anxiety, listen to reliable news. Avoid fake news, and if you need to turn off your cell phone to limit intake, then do it. Number 4. Discover new things or learn new hobbies. Examples are online research, learn to play guitar, learn to cook, read books, and etc. Number 5. Devote yourself to wellness. Meditate, pray, and have time for yourself. Number six, if you need help, then ask for it. You can message your friends or relatives, and you can message, call, or text these numbers. Tandaan, health is wealth. Your mental health matters. This has been Coach MJ. Thank you for watching.